Welcome to Move of the Day. Today I'm going to be talking about Falcon Boost 236 h To start off, in new bro. This move is okay. It's fairly fast, it's an overhead, minus 2 on block. However, it can be 2 h and it also loses to projectiles, and can even lose to Super Dash. So it's good to get in and call an assist, but only if the opponent is blocking. It's a reactable overhead, around 24 frames startup. It can be 2 h but if you block it, he's minus 3, so it's usually safer to just block it. If it hits, he gets a full combo afterwards. In combos, Modern Breeze Big Chief is it's his usual combo player, since it can lead to sliding knockdown with Jump Dragon Rush, and that leads to a strong Oki situation. However, you can forego the Oki to go for a restand mix-up, and which you leave the opponent standing in the fat sauce and break them out of it with, with a move that leaves them standing, then mix them. The advantage after breaking them out of the fat toss heavily depends on the length of the combo. Therefore, mix can be coming through or not through depending on how long the combo is. For example, any of Majin Buu's solo mix up options after fat toss, such as by LLL tip grab or IDJ on L, will only work after short combos. If you see Martin would go for a solo recent mix up without an assist after a long combo, such as a vibrate three jump, you can jump out or check him with a button, since he is not plus. The other way to do recent mix ups is with an assist, which is the best way to do it since it does not depend on combo length. The two ways to restand with an assist are the JM restand method and the true restand method. The JM restand method involves doing a rising JM and calling your assist then falling and doing either a 2L or an air dash JL overhead. The JM will hit you and get you out of the fat sauce, and then you'll be forced to block the assist. The way to counteract this when defending is to try to reflect the assist call on reaction. If you do this, the Majin Buu can't properly mix you up. However, this can be baited by Majin Buu doing fast jump JM and calling an assist. In this situation, if you're matching 4S to reflect, it'll become a 6S input and the assist will hit you. But if Majin Buu does dash jump JM, his mix options are very limited. He can either do land 2L low, or he can do cross back up JM, but that is reactable. So he does not get proper mix. Therefore, it's very strong to represent the defensive option of reflecting before since a beta, because then if you block, he loses his mix options. The other and stronger assist restand method is the true assist restand, in which the assist itself hits you out and leaves you standing, and then Majin Buu mixes you. In this situation, it doesn't matter if you react to the assist, since Majin Buu can still bait your reflect by not attacking after the assist hits you. So for this, you have to guess and reflect Majin Buu himself. But once again, your reflect can be baited, this time by uh, air dash cross up data, which will cross up your reflect input. So to recap, make sure to check Modern Buu's fake solo mix-ups by checking the length of his combos. If it's a long combo, he can't do 5LLL mix on his own, or IUJML. You can jump out or press a button if it's a long combo. With assisted restand mix-ups, make sure to represent the defensive option you're reflecting so that they have to guess what you'll do and bait it. Make sure to check what assist the Majin Buu player is running when you're able to. If it's an assist that leaves the opponent standing, then you know that they'll go through restand mix-ups. If it's an assist with 35 frames or more blocks done, you know they can go for JM restand mix-ups. If they do not have an assist that leaves them standing, or has 35 frames or more blocks done, they do not have real assist restand options, and you can reflect even those ones. I hope this video helped you understand Martin B. 6 h and J2P6H, as well as how to defend against them. Thanks for watching.